Stop what you're doing. Mel's on the MIC has three things you need to know. Oh, uh, yeah. Right now. Number three. Police are looking at surveillance cameras and nearby buildings for possible leads into Empire star Jesse So May's alleged hate crime attack that happened on Monday night. Now, So May's Empire character is a gay rapper named Jamal Lyons. So May is also gay in real life. Last week, he received a death threat in the mail that mentioned both his race and sexual orientation, but there's no word on if it's connected to this attack. In the meantime, lots of celebrities and stars are showing their love for Samae and sending him support. You can read more about this story on our website at MyKids1031.com. Number two. State Representative Richard Pena Raymond of Laredo is introducing House Bill 1100. This bill specifically calls for the repeal of blue laws in order for liquor stores to open up on Sundays. Thank you, Lord, because why are we still holding on to blue laws? It's just a whole new millennium, and we're still hanging on to laws from the 1800s. <laughs> this is crazy. Hopefully, y'all can make this bill into a law. Can we do that, Texas? Number one. Just once, can we figure out what we keep doing wrong? And some sad news to pass along. Legendary R&B singer James Ingram has died. He was only 66 years old. There's no official word on when or how he passed away, but TMZ is reporting that he was battling brain cancer. Ingram had plenty of hits over his career, including two number one hits, Baby Come to Me with Patty Austin in 1983 and I Don't Have the Heart in 1990. His other classics include Just Once, Yabo Be There with Michael McDonald, and Somewhere Out There with Linda Ronstadt from the movie American Tale. He also co-wrote the Michael Jackson smash hit PYT. You can read more about his legendary career right now on our website at MyKids1031.com and those are the three things you need to know about on this January 30th. If you missed Mills three things, catch them now at MyKids1031.com